Hello guys, um, as you can see I'm in Gary's mod and in Gary's mod I have the Stargate mod, uh, you can download this, uh, just search another YouTube video, I'm not going to be doing a tutorial on how to do it, because it's a bit long winded really, uh, and it's quite simple to do, it took me a few attempts, but hey. Um, now, what you're going to need to do for uh, a puddle jumper, now, a lot of people have, um, on the online server, have asked, how do you get the puddle jumper's shields to work? How do you get the cloaking? Um, how do you activate the Stargate when you're driving the puddle jumper? Um, so I'm going to answer all of these questions for you. Um, now to open the puddle jumper, you're going to want to go to one of the sides, not the back, one of the sides, and press E, and that should open. Um, now for shields, press Q, go to your Stargate tab here, click shield, click the clock uh, model. Uh, now you're going to want to select a few things. Uh, draw bubble uh, is, is, I think, essential. Uh, show effect when passing through shield. You don't have to have this, but I think it looks good. Um, and the most important one, the compulsory one, is auto weld. You're going to want to tick that. Um, select whatever colour you want to use, uh, select what key you want to use to toggle the uh, the shield. Uh, today I'm going to be using blue and zero, just personal favourite. Um, select the shield strength, I always pick the strongest, you're probably going to want to do the same. Now the size I normally do about 230, 250, somewhere around that. Uh, oh, sorry, 260. Um, so... What you're going to want to do is make sure it's on that. Uh, so go into the puddle jumper, and it it it's really hard to place this. So you're going to want to make it in the middle, uh, and then just left click. Now that's on. Now step outside the puddle jumper and press zero. And there we go. There's our shield. Okay. Now for the cloaking, you're going to want to go to cloaking on the tech. Clock again, um, you're going to want to click phase shifting and auto weld. Um, and don't click visible for owner, that just mucks everything up. Um, I'm going to choose uh, just dot here for the uh, tab. And size, I'm going to do about the same size. Uh, about 240, yeah, there we go. Um, and just click right beside it. There we go. Um, so if I press the dot, there we go. My puddle jump is invisible. I press it again, it's back to normal. Uh, press zero, my shield. Press dot. Invisible. Um, so yeah, that works really well. Now, let's get in the uh, puddle jumper. And try it out. So, so dot, I'm invisible, and zero, shield. Now you can have both of these on at the same time, uh, which is the beauty of it. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm gonna land now. Oh, a tip for landing. Uh, point the nose directly at the floor and then land, otherwise you hurt yourself. Um, right, let me just spawn under the Stargate quickly. Uh, let's call it uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Um, and now I'm going to dial Waterside, which is that one over there, the Atlantis one. All you need to do is press R. Let's go right next to it. Press press R. Click water side. Click dial. There we go. The Stargate's dialing. That's how you um, dial via a puddle jumper. Um, to use attack, press shift. Uh, that's pretty cool. And obviously you can shoot your darts. 
So yeah. Um, another good thing is you can go through the Stargate with invisibility on. Um, I wouldn't suggest going through the Stargate with the shield because it can muck things up. So yeah, uh, go through it with the uh, cloaking by all means, but uh, I wouldn't recommend going through a shield. Unless it's a super gate, then that's okay. But yeah. Ah, okay. oh, God, it's glitched again. There we go. Yeah, great glitch. Uh, so let's just walk out of that. Undo it. Right. Uh, you can also save your um, models in Advanced Duplicator. So, if I go to Jumper and click Open, there we go. That's my Jumper. Um, so, zero shield. There. I've also attached a Wraith Dart uh, Sucker on it, which is pretty useful. So I, I just have that there, just for the fun of it. Um, so yeah, that's all guys. If you want me to do any more Gary's Mod Stargate stuff or anything like that, uh, feel free to ask, comment on this video. But that's all.